Here at home, beach accesses are limited on South Padre Island, or they're being closed now. CBS 4 Stephen Sealy live on the island to tell us what areas are being affected and what beachgoers need to look out for, Stephen. Marcy, high surf here on South Padre Island have caused the county to close down beach access 3 to 6 as well as Boca Chica Beach. South Padre Island Beach Patrol spoke with CBS4 earlier and they say surf is heavy. People should swim with caution as debris like logs could be in the water. Beach Patrol says to watch out for surf condition flags because they indicate how severe waves are. The red flag can uh, red flags are for heavy surf to dangerous conditions, yellow for calm to moderate and blue is for venomous marine life. And if there isn't a flag shown, that doesn't mean that water is safe. Beach Patrol says riptides can be predicted, can't be predicted on where they will happen within city limits. Rip currents can move around anywhere. So just watching out for stuff like that, making sure you're not diving in because you don't know how deep it is. The sandbars move around when we have storm surges come through like this. So you just want to watch out for where you're, where you're uh, moving in and out of the water. Beach Patrol will continue to patrol as long as they have accesses to the beaches. Lieutenant Pig mentioned that parents need to be vigilant when they're watching their kids play in the beaches. Isla Blanca Park and Andy Bowie Park remained open at this time. And according to National Weather, National Weather Service, riptides and high surf look to continue through the evening and into Thursday morning. Live on South Padre Island, Stephen Seeley, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.